Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Naturally LJ. I know some of you guys are so excited to see that I finally am doing back to doing my YouTube videos. You guys, I haven't done a video in over two months. And I have had several of you guys reach out to me like, LJ, what's going on? Where are you at? We miss you. When are you going to do videos again? So here I am, you guys. I had to take a little break, a little mental break. I was actually going through a few things in my life, personal life, that I needed to just kind of back away um, from everything. And then, of course, you guys know how I am on my channel. I want to be my best self. And I don't want anybody to pick up on any kind of energies where, okay, LJ's not acting right. No. So, I am perfectly fine. I do still solicit all you guys' prayers. If you know um, the words of prayer, please just lift my name up in prayers. I want to thank all of my brand new subscribers because even though I have not been on um, here on YouTube, I've probably gained over 100 close to maybe 200 subscribers. I'm still getting comments of people that just figuring out or finding my channel. I appreciate you all. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, definitely make sure you do so. And also make sure you like each and every one of my videos. If you guys can, that'll let YouTube know that you love the content that Naturally LJ puts out. So in this video, you guys, as you guys can see, I'm looking like a a newbie and queen kind of type thing here. I promise I'm in for the night. Um, in this video, you guys, I'm going to be doing a, a first impression um, a video of some natural hair products that were sent to me by a black-owned company. So I'm going to tell you guys just a little bit about the products. And I am going to, as of now, um, I ask my Instagram followers. If you're not following me on Instagram, definitely make sure you're following me at Naturally LJ um, to let me know if they want me to do a flat twist or a twist out you guys know anytime i'm trying a new product i love to do a twist out to see how it performs so i may do like some twist twist uh flat twist in the front and then twist that in the back because I still got the kind of twist. I need to know how this product gonna work on my hair so you guys this company is called Revlant R E L E V A N T Beauty Revlant Beauty and I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right like I said it's a black owned company they sent me these products you guys months ago and I continuously um, was talking to the owner letting her know I promise you I'm gonna get this video out but right now I need some me time to get myself together I want to be my best self on my platform she was very understanding so you know we got that out of the way but yes these products um Revlant Beauty um I'm going to be using of course their deep conditioner this is the buttermilk mango and shea moisturizer and softening deep conditioner it is for curly coily and wavy hair types um what else this is their buttermilk bouncy curl styling cream so this is what I'll be twisting with you guys um and I'll show you guys the consistency of these products also they sent me the conditioner this is the buttermilk anti-breakage detangling conditioner for curly coily and wavy hair types and what else what else this is the leave-in conditioner so I'm going to put use to all of these products okay this is their cleansing buttermilk African black soap cleansing and moisturizing shampoo you guys know I love anything moisturizing especially a moisturizing shampoo definitely for the summer and winter months you want to make sure you have a good moisturizing shampoo it is non-stripping I just had my hair recolored um detangles um, hair and it's sulfate free and also it is color safe so I was very very proud to see that this shampoo is color safe what else what else okay here are their hair growth oil this is their hair growth oil it's a uh, strengthening and repair scalp oil so I can't wait to use that and last but not least here is their daily use moisturizing and sealing oil. So I'll definitely be doing the lock method after I wash my hair before, right before I get ready to twist uh, my hair. And of course, at the end of this video, you guys, I will give you my commentary on how I like these products, each one of them. So you guys know, I literally had people saying, LJ, we miss your long videos. Y'all know how thorough I am when it comes to videos. I'm just not these seven, eight minute videos. No, we're going to talk. 
You know, so if that ain't your thing, I understand. You know, maybe another YouTube blogger, natural hair YouTube a blogger is, is for you. But for the people that is, that's team LJ, okay, they love the long videos. Okay, I'm going to try not to make it too long, but hey, every time I say that, it is what it is. But I promise you. I promise you about 98% love them, okay? So if you in that 2% that don't, hey, you know what? Girl, bye. I don't know what to tell you. But anyway, <laughs> so this was the letter or the thank you note that they sent me. Thank you for reviewing our products. We, are, we really appreciate it and looking forward to working with you again in the near future. Love Revlon Beauty. Okay, so what I'm getting ready to do now is go ahead. I think that's everything. I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair. Um, and I'll come back and show you guys how it suds up the lather. Those clips that will be inserted will basically be me probably voiceovering. And then right after I get done at the very end, um, then I'll come back. And I'm probably going to, of course, let my hair over. Mm over dry <laughs> air dry so definitely i'll come back and um show you guys me using every each product and um you'll probably get my facial expressions on them or whatever you know but definitely at the end is when i'll do my commentary so i'll be right back so i'm going to begin with the revelant beauty buttermilk african black soap cleansing and moisturizing shampoo it states that it is non-stripping strengthens detangles hair is sulfate free and color safe and that's a plus for us color treated naturalistas you guys as you can see upon uh, putting the shampoo on my hair it instantly began to lather which was very impressive for me um you guys know i am not um, lightweight or light-handed when it comes to shampoo but I honestly feel like a little bit of the shampoo probably goes a long way so I probably use too much but just very impressed with how the shampoo is making my hair and scalp feel already as you guys can see my curls are beginning to pop so uh, a okay so I'm getting ready to now go proceed with the next step in this video so look at the curl poppage okay all right see you guys in the next clip Okay, you guys, so I am back, and I have already started with the deep conditioner on my head. Okay, so I may be doing some voiceover slash coming back to tell you guys how I feel because I have to share this with you guys. Um, the definition that the even the deep conditioner is giving my hair, you guys, I left the front two um, sections of my hair completely untouched because I was really very impressed at how... This deep, not the deep condition, but the shampoo, once I washed the shampoo out of my hair, I was very, okay, knock your eye out, LJ. Okay, I was very, very impressed at how the deep, not the deep, why I keep saying the deep condition, the African black soap um, left my hair really, really defined, like, I don't, I don't, I don't ever recall really paying attention to any other shampoo that did that, but it really, really defined my curls, that shampoo. I honestly only washed my hair one time because I felt like my hair was completely clean, um, doing it one time. You guys know how you can just, uh, let me wash again because I don't know. After that one time, my hair was completely clean. I don't feel like I needed to go back in a second time this line also has a conditioner that i opted out of using just for the sake of me getting my hair recolored not too long ago i would rather do the deep conditioner this time and possibly next time i can go ahead and use their conditioner so um some people um use a conditioner right after shampoo then still go through with a deep conditioner please let me know in the comments below if you do that me personally i I do not so it was either use the conditioner or either use um the deep conditioner so of course i opted to use the deep conditioner this conditioner says to leave on your hair for 20 minutes or you can apply heat with it i'm really trying to stay away from heat y'all i am seriously on the fence about if i want to blow dry my hair just a little bit to give it a stretch because you guys know I do not like first day hair. I have type 4 hair, which means 
it really shrinks up so i'm really going back and forth in my mind and i will make that decision within the next 20 minutes if i'm going to stretch my hair out just a little bit for the style because i just y'all i don't like it if you guys have been following me and rocking out with lj you guys know y'all know i'm not um very light-handed with products very very heavy-handed but um yeah um so i'm really Oh my God, I'm really on the fence. I really need a good trim. You guys know I normally trim. Look at that. I need a good trim. Um, and I normally trim my own, but this time I think I may go and let a friend of mine uh, trim my hair for me or maybe cut it in a shape. We'll see what happens, but definitely um, absolutely loving the definition that this deep conditioner is giving me like i said at the very end we'll talk about it oh i didn't even show you guys um the thick and creamy consistency of this um deep conditioner you guys it is absolutely wonderful y'all know i love thick and creamy products also um it doesn't take a lot but i'm just heavy-handed y'all know that so but anyway so i'm gonna let this sit on my hair for a little bit kind of do some things around the house and then i will come back and rinse it out and get ready to uh well i'll rinse it out and i'll be making my mind up in the meantime if i'm a stretch my hair just a tad bit y'all seriously i do not want tight hair on the first day I, I just i can't stand it so anyway let me know in the comments below if while using an entire product line do you use the conditioner and the deep conditioner or you just opt out for one let me know in the comments below i'll see you guys in the next clip all right, you guys, so I am back and I have just rinsed the deep conditioner out of my hair. I wanted to show you guys what my hair looked like with no product in it. I haven't put anything in it yet. It really defined my curls. I really need to get my hair cut into some kind of shape because I'm just looking like real crazy. But don't sleep on your girl because you know when i get them twist outs right it's gonna be mom but anyway yeah i just wanted y'all to see the definition um i see my little curls you know they got a little curl right there you know th you know the side i don't it it's a mess i don't know what's going on but anyway as you guys can see um my little ringlets are sticking out um in some areas of my hair and like i said this is just me rinsing the deep conditioner out so as i was thinking about it um and you guys i'm taking a wide tooth comb and i'm just gently going through my hair as you guys can see with complete ease this is right after rinsing the revlant revlant i think that's it revlant beauty buttermilk mango and shea moisturizing and softening deep conditioner out of my head okay so as you guys can see i'm able to just take this wide tooth comb um and just completely just glide through with ease i mean it doesn't even need to be detangled sometimes we as naturalistas will take a detangling tool not a detangling tool well a detangling tool and or some kind of product to detangle our hair not needed with the Revlon, Revlon Beauty. Um, so you guys definitely, I will of course be leaving all their information in uh, the description box below. Definitely check them out, especially if you are one who loves to support Black-owned businesses, you guys. So far, so good. Um, the true test of um, time for me will be uh, to see how these, uh, this, uh, this, uh, <laughs> cream uh defines my definition of my twist outs like i said you guys oh i was saying i am going to blow dry my hair just a little bit okay maybe i don't know just a little bit because i do want some stretch you guys like i just don't like it and i really want to be able to like my hair and that's using any product um on first day hair so i really want to be able to um and do a good defined definition, a uh, twist out, defined twist out um, with my hair stretched. And so, yeah, that's what I'll be doing. So, what I'm going to go do right now is blow dry my hair. And I'm going to go ahead and start twisting. I will leave the front loose so you guys, so I can come back and show you guys 
um, the buttercream and everything. So you won't see me twist my hair on camera. You guys know how I do a twist out, but you will see me do the very front of it um, right before the end of this video up until tomorrow for the big takedown and reveal. So I'll see you guys here in just a little bit. <laughs> Hi guys, all right, I am back. And as you guys can see, I only have a little bit of maybe two more twists left to do. I did go ahead and blow dry my hair out because I did not want the tightness of a um, of a first day hair. I told you guys I was just gonna blow dry it out. So I lightly blow dried it out. I've already twisted both of it off of camera, of course. And I did do the little band two knots on the ends. Um, and I'll show you guys um how that um how i do that so what i'm getting ready to do now i did want to come back on camera and show you guys i'm using the leave-in conditioner which the leave-in smells good all of the product smells good it's kind of like a um i can't really describe the smell of these products if um clean is a word um they just smell really clean i'm sorry i have forgot about the oil i was doing the lock method of course you definitely want to make sure your hair is completely moisturized i don't know what some the uh, some of the states you guys live in i'm here in north carolina so you definitely want to make sure that your hair is moisturized so doing the lock method and i'm just gonna do these two twists on camera and um and that's gonna be it so my hair would definitely for sure be dry in the morning um or tomorrow when i ever get ready to take my hair loose so just wanted to show you guys um just me twisting and what i do is add just a little bit of the eco style gel at the end and i bend to not the end it gives like um a really really pretty um twist out with a little um just a little cuteness on the ends um, this is one of my styles that I like to do. So, so far, um, really the true test of time as far as definition, I'll definitely let you guys know. Um, the cream feels really good. It's the Buttermilk Bouncy Curl Styling Cream by Revlent Beauty. Um, and as you guys can see, that's how much I've used thus far. Just twisting my hair. So, I only have one more twist to do. And that's going to be it. So um, I'm going to sleep on my satin uh, pillowcase tonight or either put on one of my bonnets. And I'll be back tomorrow for the takedown. But you guys, so far, so good with these products. Just really felt like with the shampoo, my hair was completely clean. clean. Um, one time, um, I was able to really detangle my hair with ease using, and just a little bit of eco style on the end, so I can get that bantu knot on the end. And, um, I'm just really pleased thus far with the product. So, of course, the true test will definitely be tomorrow, just to see how my hair, um, basically and what i did do with some of the hair growth oil was put definitely put it down the middle and i actually before i began at right after i um blow dried my hair i just took it and it has one of those like the medicine dopplers and i just kind of went through my hair and just put it through um you guys, my edges are really suffering. Um, you guys know I was doing a series on the back, the nape of my hair at one point in time. And it has honestly grown back in. It was just gone. I'm like, I don't know what's going on with that. But I'm so scared. I want some um, braids so bad, you guys. But I'm so scared because of my edges. The edges of my hair have always been the most fragile um, parts of my hair. And I envy other naturalistas that just have full like edges not envy but it is what it is i mean i'm like gosh how do you get your edges so full and so thick so y'all definitely leave me some comments below let me know what your um what your um uh, dislike is about your hair but as you guys can see the hair is shiny 
Oh my God. I mean, just off of the lock method using these products, my hair is shiny. The twists look absolutely wonderful. So I am expecting a great, great twist out. So I will definitely be back on tomorrow for the takedown. So I'm going to get ready to go to sleep. And um, I will see you guys tomorrow. All right. All right, you guys, so it's the next day and my hair is completely dry. Um, I am now getting ready to take the Revlon Beauty Daily Moisturizing Hair Oil just to coat my fingers as I unravel my twist. You guys know to make sure you take some form of an oil to make sure that you reduce as much frizz as possible. So I am just taking my hair loose, absolutely loving the definition thus far that the... Um, cream gave my hair you guys um i mean it it takes a lot to impress me but the shine and just the definition so far you know revelant beauty you did your thing okay you know so but just um definitely making sure each twist is unraveled you guys definitely this t uh, process can and it most of the time is the longest process of um your hair because you want to make sure that you are being gentle with your hair not to snag your hair and definitely want to eliminate as much frizz as possible but you guys the definition do you all see the shine that is in my hair so yes Revlon Beauty next clip all right you guys so I am back and this is the finished product of my hair I absolutely love it it is absolutely gorgeous um oh my gosh y'all if y'all have not tried these products or ever heard of these products the link will be in the there information will be in the description box below you guys i am absolutely loving my hair i'm gonna do a little spin around so y'all can see the back it's bouncy it's shiny i absolutely love it i mean i really think i did a good job with stretching my hair y'all because this is a twist out that, oh my God, like I cannot wait to inbox the owner and let her know that I absolutely love these products, you guys. Like I say, please forgive me if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but I'm pronouncing it relevant, relevant beauty. You guys, they have an entire collection. I'm not for sure on how much this collection is, but you can definitely follow them on Instagram. I'm sure they have a website. I will link all of the information below. You guys, this hair is bomb.com. My color is just so vibrant. Like my color wasn't stripped at all. My color is just so vibrant. My hair is shiny. Of course, you guys know I do. As with any of you guys should, put some type of oil on your fingers while separating your braid outs, twist outs, flat outs, just to eliminate frizz. I always say with natural hair, it is inevitable. You will accumulate some type of frizz. But if you can help it, definitely try to make sure you put some oil on your fingers. I laid my edges down. Somebody may ask. I am now using the 24-hour edge tamer. Uh, it is by Eben, you guys. I used to be a huge fan of the main choice laid back effortlessly um, edge control. But you guys, I found this right here. Um, you probably can't see the price. It's $5.99 and I haven't looked back. It lays my edges all day. I'm just absolutely loving how bouncy my hair is. And that's just with minimum separation. I didn't even um, separate it all. But the rest of this weekend, it'll get bigger and bigger and bigger. So even tonight when I go to bed, I no longer have to retwist my hair at night. Unless I'm just sitting in the room watching TV and I'm bored and I feel like it. Other than that, I can just put on a sleep satin bonnet. And go to bed okay so but y'all i am absolutely loving it um i talked a little bit about the products of course while i was using it the cleansing shampoo the buttermilk african black soap you guys as you guys can see it's like a i don't like the smell at all i will say uh of this soap but you guys it did my hair absolutely one day maybe that's the african black soap i'm not used to that raw african black soap but you guys when i tell you 
it has been a very long time since I've been able to use a shampoo and after one wash, my hair was squeaky clean. So I didn't have to go back in again and use it again. You guys know I use their um, buttermilk, mango, and shea moisturizing and softening deep conditioner. When I use this product, I was able to just glide my fingers through my hair. It actually, it actually detangled it as well. You guys saw me combing through, no snags. It was just the the comb was just gliding through. And of course, last but not least, well, this well, y'all saw me use the leave-in conditioner because I wanted to. Y'all, yeah, y'all know how to do twist outs, okay? If somebody wants a more in-depth twist out video, please leave it in the comment section below. Below, you know, I got you. But um, definitely use the leave-in. So I did the lock method: your leave-in, your oil, and then your cream. And then last but not least was their buttermilk bouncy curl styling cream, you guys. This product absolutely amazing smells good i mean just i mean these products if they are lj approved y'all know that you know i'm gonna be honest on my channel especially when i'm doing first impressions of reviews of products i liked every single um product from this line did not get to use the conditioner we'll definitely try this next time because i'm either gonna do a deep conditioner or a conditioner i'm not gonna do both um but definitely we'll try the conditioner next time i don't think i'll be disappointed at all um and then of course their growth oil they have a hair and scalp growth oil which you saw me putting it in between my scalp last night and just kind of massaging my scalp with so what do i think overall about these products absolutely wonderful definitely get your hands on them i will try to do my research and put the price list down in the description box however if i do not go do your own research okay i definitely will leave their instagram and their website so you can check out these products you guys but I mean, I am absolutely loving my hair. So thank you, Revlent Beauty, for um, seeking me out to do a first impression on your hair care line. I absolutely love it. And I can't wait to use it again. I mean, because for when a product gives my hair the dope definition like this, it instantly becomes a staple of mine because my hair is really kind of hard to tame and y'all see yeah bouncy okay that that bouncy it is, yeah it did say what did it say it is the buttermilk a bouncy curls okay so the bouncy the bounciness that's in my hair okay let me stop the bounciness i just absolutely love it the shine the definition is completely dope okay i love it so anyway you guys i have to run i got some things i gotta take care of today glad to be back okay you guys thank you guys for all of you guys that checked on me and wonder lj where are you at i am back girl okay i'm back but um anyway let me know um i do have some new new stuff going on behind me you guys if you guys have followed me on instagram and of course looked at my um uh world natural hair show haul put it down in the comments below what got what would you like to see me use next okay i love you guys thank you guys so much for rocking out with your girl thank you guys so much for being patient with me if you have not yet subscribed to the channel please do so and i will see you guys in my next video Mwah.